Friends are as companions on a journey who ought to aid each other to persevere in the road to a happier life. As soon as laws are necessary for man, they are no longer fit for freedom. No one is free who has not obtained the empire, life itself. Do not say a little in many words, but a great deal in few. As long as man continues to be the ruthless destroyer of lower living beings, he will never know health or peace. For as long as men massacre animals, they will kill each other too. It is better to be silent or to say things of more value than silence. Sooner throw a pearl at a hazard than an idle or useless word. Concern should drive us into action and not into a depression. No man is free who cannot control himself. Choose rather to be strong of soul than strong of body. There is geometry in the humming of the strings. There is music in the spacing of the spheres. Rest satisfied with doing well and leave others to talk of you as they will. There is a good principle which created order, light, and humanity, and an evil principle which created chaos, darkness, and despair. The oldest, shortest words, yes and no, are those which require the most thought. Above the cloud with its shadow is the star with its light. Above all things, reverence thyself. The most momentous thing in human life is the art of winning the soul to good or evil. Begin thus from the first act and proceed in conclusion. Consider before acting to avoid foolishness. It is the worthless man who speaks and acts thoughtlessly. Without justice, no realm may prosper. Ability and necessity dwell near to each other. Evolution is the law of life. Number is the law of the universe. Unity is the law of God. He buries gold who hides the truth. Music is the harmonization of opposites, the conciliation of warring elements. Meditate upon my counsel. Love them, follow them. To the divine virtues will they know how to lead you. I swear it by the one who in our hearts engraved the sacred tetrad, symbol immense and pure, source of nature and model of the gods.
Know that death comes to everyone and that wealth will sometimes be acquired, sometimes lost. Whatever griefs mortals suffer by divine chance, whatever destiny you have, do not complain. But it is right to improve it as much as you can. And remember this, fate does not give very many of these griefs to the good people. Step not beyond the beam of balance. No one can be free who is a slave to and ruled by their passions. It is difficult to walk at one and the same many paths of life. It is reserved only for God and angels to be lookers on. Let no one persuade you by word or deed to do or say whatever is not best for you. Respect yourself most of all. Numbers rule the universe. Let not sleep fall upon your eyes till you have thrice reviewed the transaction of the past day. Where have I turned aside from rectitude? What have I been doing? What have I left undone which I ought to have done? To cognize the divine essence is the highest purpose of soul sent by the Creator to earth. Envy has been and is and shall be the destruction of many. What is there that envy hath not defamed, or malice left undefiled? Truly no good thing. Before all, be real. Only the truth gives the word the Orpheus power. Friendship is one soul in two bodies. The earth affords a lavish supply of richness of innocent foods and offers you banquets that involve no bloodshed or slaughter. Only beasts satisfy their hunger with flesh and not even all those because horses, cattle, and sheep live on grass. Truth is to be sought with a mind purified from the passions of the body. Having overcome evil things, you shall experience the union, the union of mortal divinity, A stone is frozen music. Govern your tongue before all other things following the gods. Practice justice in word and deed and do not get in the habit of acting thoughtlessly about anything. The stars in the heavens sing a music. If only we had ears to hear. Thought is an idea in transit, which when once released can never be lured back, nor the spoken word recalled. Know yourself and you will know the universe.
also in life. Some into the services of fame and others money. But the best choice is that of those few who spend their time in the contemplation of nature and as lovers of wisdom. Some are the slaves of ambition or money, but others are interested in understanding life itself. These give themselves the name of philosophers, and they value the contemplation and discovery of nature beyond all other pursuits. Reason is immortal. All else is temporary. Write in the sand the flaws of your friend. If there be light, then there is darkness. If cold, heat. If height, depth. If solid, fluid. If hard, soft. If rough, smooth. If calm, tempest. If prosperity, adversity. If life, death. Geometry is knowledge of the eternally existent. The octave formed a circle and gave our noble earth its form. God built the universe on numbers. The experience of life in a finite, limited body is specifically for the purpose of discovering and manifesting supernatural existence. 